Okay, <laughs> there we go. Okay, so let me fix a few things up. There we go. There we go. There we go. Okay, so I'm kind of surprised. So we're here about to play Lies of P. So if you don't know what this is, this is a Bloodborne style Pinocchio game. But the interesting thing is this game was supposed to come out tomorrow. Yeah, it was supposed to come out tomorrow. And I literally just got done like half an hour ago. I just got done doing a live stream of me playing the Force Portal game because I thought this game was be coming out tomorrow. But I guess the devs must have just released the game 24 hours early just because. I don't know. But I'm not going to complain because this is a game I've been looking forward to. I did play the demo a while back when it first came out before I even started doing Twitch. So I know a few things, but of course, these Souls games are big. So let's go again to it. But yeah, if you don't know, this is a Bloodborne-style Pinocchio game. And should be a fun one at that. In honor of the great writer Carol Pelodi. I'm guessing that's the person who actually wrote the actual Pinocchio story. Geppetto's puppet. We need your help. And there's a bar right now, Pinocchio. Yeah, this game was supposed to come out tomorrow. I don't know why it's out early, but I'm not going to complain. This is going to be fun. As I... What was that? Oh. Okay. I played the demo a while back, so... Got rid of controls. I am also playing it on controller instead of keyboard and mouse, because... That's how I played Dark Souls 1, 2, and 3, Bloodborne, Sacred. I played those with a controller. So I think that worked better than keyboard and mouse here. Ah, there you are. I've been looking all over for you. As I just wake up in a random part of a train. Gemini. They got Jiminy too. Jiminy. But we have to hurry. My name Our friend Jiminy Cricket. Please come to Hotel Crot and I'll explain what's happening. Jiminy, please escort him to the hotel. Okay, now we got the lamp that's supposed to be uh, Jiminy Cricket. Give me a second while I do a bit of audio adjustment right there. There we go. Okay, use belt. Okay, upper, lower belt. X use belt item. Okay. Hold A down to activate the extra bug. Okay. Let's go ahead and turn on Jiminy. And this for re weapon durability, but we don't have a weapon just yet. Let's get you out of there. Find something that might help. Oh, we're about to get some weapons. Yeah, there's a tomato pack puppets all around. The hotel. Okay. Balanced dexterity strength. Hmm. Normally I go for strength when I'm playing most Souls games. But strength usually means you're a bit slower at the attacks. Back when I played the demo, I chose balance. With how the enemies were attacking, a lot of it being very much parrying based as well as just regular attacks, I think balance would be the way to go. So let's just go with balance for now. Okay, sounds like a plan. Okay, B to dodge slash dash. Guard. Lock on. Hold A for the extra bag. Switch weapons. And we got the one weapon. Okay. Regular light attack is that one. Okay. Raver is Pinocchio, my boy. Got yeah, first fight. Yeah, let's just say these puppets, they're not a big fan of humans. Just slaughter them all. Jeez. 
Okay, let's see how I am by pairing. Okay, I don't think I did that well on that one. We all know you're not dead. Now, come on. Oh, he dropped something. Thought tooth wheel. Okay, that's uh, that's for dexterity. I'm not dexterity. Durability. Yeah, human endeavors. All the humans over here are dead. Okay, we got a pulse cell. Okay, these are for the HP. Yep. Let's go ahead and get that just in case we get hurt. Can't go over here yet. Okay, I think I see three enemies. One standing up, two laying down. Let's start off easy with the one that was laying down over here. Here we go. Okay. Nah, I didn't parry right there. There we go. Need to get my timing right with these parries. It's hard to do. Let's see if I can do it here. Come on, hit me. That, I failed at that. Okay, try it again. Nope, I failed at that as well. Okay, you know what? I'll go ahead and just kill you. Yeah, it's going to take me a good bit to get used to the timing to be able to do these parries. Let's go ahead and use one of these. Holding bees to run. Okay, we can't open that yet. That door is open. And this is locked, of course. Guard. You can block enemy attacks by guarding. If you guard six, will attack. Take reduced damage, will consume stamina. Let's. Yeah, but trying to do like the whole pairing thing. Yeah, the perfect guard, it's, it's hard to do. Yeah, you don't receive any damage to do a perfect guard, but it's so hard to do a perfect guard. Oh, no, you don't. Okay. And there's also the back attacks. To slaughter him. Thank you for the Fable Catalyst. Okay, there's a path down here and a path up here. Let's check down first, then we'll move up. What have we got in here? A uh, high? Does he think we can't see him? There we go. Use Legion Arm. I'll pick a really Never mind, yep. One hit KO there. But it has a durability bar at top at uh, the bomb left. Can't go wrong with Fermite. Okay, let's continue on over here. Yeah, rear field attack. Move from behind. Move in slowly. Boom! There we go. Simple and easy. Him, not so much. Okay, let's see if I can do a perfect guard here. There we go. Yeah, it's still... It's going to take a good bit to get used to it. It's not exactly a specialty of mine. Being able to do guards and such. Okay, there's a guy over there. If anyone finds this note, get out of the station and run. Be sure to steer clear of the waiting room. I saw a huge puppet smashing people to death in there. I locked the door, but I don't know if that'll work. At least it should stop people from randomly coming in. I'm going to die soon, so I want to help even if it's not much. Please survive anyone. Yeah, these puppets. They went haywire. Okay, let me see if I can go up behind them and do... A back attack. You big stab. Boom. There we go. Okay, hello. No, you don't. Okay, so, uh oh. 
Okay, that was not a perfect dodge. Dim Ergo Fragments. Okay. Uh, okay. Let's likely are some of these items. As a sort to me, the character upon use. No, thank you. Now made to submit puppet abilities, rapidly charged fables. Okay. It's a throwing object. Okay, so it's for distractions. Sure, might. Okay, it's like a Molotov. There we go. There we go, Mr. Powers. I found it correct. Oh, that's the currency in this game. Okay. Now this area cleared. Lock device. There are doors and ladders all throughout Karat that are locked by devices. You can lock these doors, go down the ladder to create shortcuts. Okay, let's definitely talk about this one. That's not going to go well, is it? Well, at least we got the shortcut, but... Well, let's see how well we can do here. Can I sneak up on him? There's my answer to that. Okay. Uh... Ow, okay, that did not go well. There we go. Ow, okay, I did not expect a double there. Let's see, how much damage could I do if I were to- Okay, that was not the plan. I'm gonna get stuck back here. Okay, I only got one to healing thing, so I need to be careful about how I do this. Okay, you have a lot of HP here, buddy. All charge for attack while you're attacking a white animal up here. This happens, you can make the enemy stagger for, for charge attack or feeble arts. Okay, so... Ow! So, this attack! There we go! Main entrance. Okay. Let's go ahead and use a heal. <laughs> that was getting close to bad. Saw a tooth wheel. Nice. Okay, but we took him out. So let's continue on. And we got the key for up here. Do I have a stand up bar? Okay, yeah, it's up on top left. Okay, it's a green one. Oh, yeah, it doesn't remind you when you first open those gates in Bloodborne to see Yarnum. I don't know what to tell you, man. Karat Central Station Plaza. Rainy night. Well, yes, it is very much a rainy night. Hair Star Geezer. This is like our game's version of the Monfires. Sorry, just full of coverage P. Yep. This is called a Stargazer. A marvelous device the stalkers used in the past. As we are, okay. we are not strong enough to beat the puppets. But if I lend my power to this stargazer for a moment, gather ergo, clever one. This stargazer will make you stronger. But the stargazer's strength doesn't last forever, so be careful with it. Hurry up and come to Hotel Krat. Okay, well, let's go ahead and level up over here. Vitality, uh... Okay, that one does HP and stuff. Guard regain? Okay, that's not bad, actually. Because it definitely seems like guarding is going to be important for this one. As well as the physical damage reduction. Okay. Make your vats for stamina. Stamina would probably be very helpful as well. Ask to you that's legion and weight. Oh, of course there's a weight limit. Wait, what does legion do? Uh... It does not tell me, so that's fun. 
Okay, motivity. Okay, that one's just for duck uh, reductions of damage rate and resistances. Okay, techniques. Wait, no, wait, no, that's different. Wait. Okay, so it's kind of like strength. Yeah, it upgrades physical tax as well. I see. So motivity and technique are kind of like strength and dexterity for this one. And advance? Legion, disruptions. Okay, I'm guessing that's more towards like the more magic, I guess. I don't know how this game is going to do magic and whatnot. Because, uh... Well, Bloodborne didn't have magic, it had the blood arts. I'm guessing it's similar to that. Arcane and blood arts. But we're not going to focus on that. I think for now, uh, let's see. We got, we got enough to do two levels. Okay. Nasty. I don't know how well capacity might do here. We'll definitely do one for vitality. Damn, probably could be very helpful, though. Technique, motivity. I think I'm going to go motivity because I'm guessing that's more towards, like, strength side. And I tend to go more towards strength and dexterity in most of these, like, soul games. Boom. Level up. We're not too far away from leveling up again. Actually, we just need to fight, like, one more enemy. I mean, we could also use a fragment, but I'd rather just... Well, here's an enemy right here. Let's see if I can perfect guard this. That did not work at all. Okay, how much did he give me? Not enough. Just one more. Oh! Oh, oh! Of course there's a dog. Okay. Oh, there we go. Left arm of steel. There we go. Tim go fragment. And now we got enough to uh, do another level up real quick. We'll do it on... Let's get the stamina up. I think those are like the main ones I'm going to be focusing on is health, stamina, and strength. Yeah. We'll go with that. At least until we learn more about what the other effects do, what not. Oh. Uh oh. Oh now. Oh crap. Oh, I gained all of our attention. Okay, that's not a good start. Okay. Okay, this is really not a good start. Uh, how much stamina I got? The, what the? Why did windows suddenly pop up? No, now is not the time. Okay, you can stop. Ah. No. Ow. Again, windows stop popping up. Seriously, almost got killed by windows. Seriously, not. Cool at all. There we go. That would have been. That would have sucked. Okay, I'm low on HP. Let's go ahead and use one of these. Looks like the dog dropped something as well, so let's grab this real quick. Fable Catalyst. Fable Catalyst. There we go. Gotta time it. You can get both of them. Crot times issue. 183. The Crot Grand exhi uh, uh, Exhibition has been delayed. This decision made to protect the citizens until the puppet frenzy that has recently paralyzed the city is under control. Yeah, I don't think it's under any sort of control, buddy. The occurrence began on Rosa Isabel Street, resulting in hundreds of casualties. While the cause is still unknown, the number of casualties and the scale of damage are both growing. As the crisis dragged on, the workshop in Vinagini Company, Krat's largest puppet factory, announced that it would offer emergency supplies to citizens and do anything it could to alleviate the situation. A task force is investigating the possibility of a fatal loss of the Grand Covenant, which is a control protocol of the workshop's puppets. However, there's no quick solution as of now with the puppet frenzy, resulting in more casualties. As the city braces for a resurgence of the petrification disease, the citizens were advised to stay indoors for their safety. However, many citizens trying to escape through Krot Central Station, intensifying the general chaos while 
we just came from Central Station and everyone was dead. So I don't think the Central Station is where you're going to want to be, you know? It's not where you're going to want to be. Oh. Back attack. There we go. Okay. I see a puppet down there. Two down there. But first, I want to see what this is. Okay, there's one puppet over there. Whoa, 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 okay. Oh, now. Okay, those guys are dead. Vivid Ergo Fragment, nice, nice. No, I meant to do a back tack. Table art, here's a guarding art. Okay. Uh, I guess I can try it now. Yep. That works. <laughs> so that's what the blue bars do. Okay. Sawtooth wheel. Use a bell item. Yeah, we know how to do it. I don't use throwing objects that much unless I need to distract an enemy. But right now, we're not distracting, we're just killing. There we go. Okay, this just leads down. Oh, there's a guy with a gun right here. Let's get rid of you before you end up actually shooting me. And goodbye. I meant to do a back attack. Oh, I did not mean to drop down here. Okay, well, at least just this one guy. As I do a perfect guard bear. Nice. Now you, you will get backstabbed. You're not coming out as alive, buddy. But, uh, nope. There we go. There we go. Dim Ergo Fragment. Very nice. Let's go back up here because there was a path to the right. Oh, it's locked door. I don't think I can open this one. Yeah, I can't open it. And we go this way. Okay. That was not... Oh, great. I hit the wall. Okay, we're getting close to having enough to level up again. Okay, I heard something say, attention, dear citizens. So, it definitely, it's obvious this puppet frenzy they talked about has escalated to basically this entire city. Because, well, the whole place is obviously in chaos. Which is, uh, that guy has a big weapon, Fury Attack. Some enemies become red and use a strong attack called a Fury Attack. You can dodge or guard one, but you can counter with a perfect guard. You do realize I don't have good timing, right? Just in case. Oh, I did not mean to use that. I meant to... Oh. Yep. I saw that one coming. <sighs> oh, wait. Here we go. No. Let me use it. No, let me use it. Uh-oh. There we go. There we go. And this can get rid of you. Oh, right in half. Saw a tooth wheel. Okay, I'm low on HP now. There we go. Yeah, one more hit and I was going to be dead. And that's not what I wanted to happen. Okay, we go left or right. Okay, I see one puppet. We need to be real careful because we're out of our healing item. Thermite. Nice. Okay, I saw the guy on the right with a gun. But first, let's deal with you. You only take three hits to kill, so you're nothing too difficult. You with the gun. I just need to walk around. Okay, you have no head. Okay, well, to be fair, you're a puppet. So, 
I guess you could live just without a head. I see a dog over there. It looks like another one of those train station puppets. Let's go up here first. Anything up here? An item, okay. Dim Ergo Fragment, okay. Oh, there was a second train station puppet. Well, not anymore. Okay, but you. Gotta be careful. You. Oh, my thing's back. Okay, I don't know how I gained it back, but okay. Get rid of you. There we go. Is you can stagger him with enough stamina? Uh-oh. Then it won't be too difficult to get rid of him. Let's grab this. Thank you, Urchin Repair Tool. Okay. Urchin Repair Tool. This only repair is weapon durability. What is that weapon durability like? Okay, it's at half. Uh, I just hold this and it brings back durability, okay? There we go. Easy and simple. We have more than enough ergo to level up, but first I want to head back over here and go on the path to the right of this. So I think if you continue that path, it'll just lead to where we're supposed to go by like looking around for extra stuff. There we go. Thank you, Jiminy. Yeah. Place has seen better days, hasn't it? It's seen better days. I do love the very steampunk feel of this. But for now, let's continue on. Okay, there were two of these guys. Yep. Ah, oh, crap. I was hoping I might be able to do a backstab. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Um, that's not good. If I can get the right timing, then... There we go. And I can just do this to you. There we go. Fable Catalyst, thank you. And the dog's not too difficult to kill. It's just two hits. His speed is more of his main issue. Fable Catalyst, there we go. As we're just covered in... Well, not blood, since these are puppets. Most likely just oil. Because they're like mechanical puppets. I do love how it looks like it's getting washed away, which makes sense because, well, it is rainy. Also, circus. Not the fun times. But I see the lock. And I saw the star gazer over here. I think that's what it is. Okay. What is this? Dude, Urko fragment. Did you try to punch me? How's that? Oh, geez, you have a lot of HP. Well, first, let's repair Stargazer. I actually don't remember this being here in this area back in the demo. This is definitely somewhere new. Now let's level up. Okay, I do want to bring... Oh, we can only level up once. Let's do more on the stamina. I want to get it equaled. And stamina seems to be really important. The more times we can attack and guard would be very helpful. What about Hello you, good there. sir? Welcome to Krat, visitor. I didn't Hello? think there were any stalkers left to fight the puppets. Well, I'm here. You didn't hear? Figures. The whole organization fell apart. All that's left are wannabes and amateurs who think they can fight on their own. That's you not going to go well. Something while you're at the festival. You can't rely on yourself alone. Out here alone? You could use some help. Here's a festival gift for you. Now get yourself something useful. Okay. We have a catalyst where you sold on that. Growing cells. Okay, that's electrical pain. This adds electricity to our weapon. This could be useful. Puppet Saber Blade. That's what we have. Just also went for you. Here. Okay, that's for the lighter build. Great sort of fake blade. That's for the more heavy strength build. I definitely want to get this. Just to get ourselves some electricity to our weapon. 
And let's go ahead and... Yeah, we'll put on there next to the healing. Nope, that's the wrong button. There we go. Okay. We got our leveled up. This is not about to go well. Rot Festival. If you weren't a fan of the circus beforehand, you're definitely not now. Let's go ahead and electrify our weapon. Whoa, whoa, whoa now, whoa now. Whoa now. Oh wow, that was a perfect guard bear. That was not. Okay. That's your head. Oh. Okay, that was a perfect dodge. Oh wait, he's flashing. There we go. Come on. There we go. Okay, let's heal up. Whoa now. Whoa now. Come on. Almost got him. No, no, no. Uh oh. Come on, almost got him. Boom, got him! The first fight is always going to be one of the easiest ones. But I'm still learning the parrying mechanics. But there we go! Now with our first guy. Quartz, very special kind of ergo with different colors and... Okay, then get to finish reading that. But now with the Parade Master. Parade Master is dead. And... Let's see. We still have one more of these. And... What we got. Actually, do I did not mean to use that. I meant to use a heal already, but there we go. But the parade masters did. Okay. I've only ever been to one circus. It was a long time ago when I was like very young. I barely remember it. Cause I was like so young. I was a little little bit of a boy. Please tell me these boxes are breakable. They look breakable. Aw. They just look so breakable, though. <laughs> Holto Krat. The greatest luxury... Seriously? The greatest luxury you will ever experience. Treat yourself to an unforgettable day. Okay. One more thing I should mention. The hotel security excludes puppets like you. Okay. So you'll have to lie to get inside. You're a special puppet after all. Yeah, the lie thing makes sense because, well, Pinocchio's story involves a lot about, like, lying and stuff. And how bad it is to lie and whatnot. Let's look around first. Any items? Yes, sir. Always look around. Always look around and explore these Souls games. There's always stuff to find. Weapons, armor, ergo in this one. <laughs> yep, and there's no ammo here next to a fountain. Jeez. There we go. Hidden Moonstone was not from this world. Heavy was most optimal enhancement material. Duh. I never get enough time to read him, do I? <laughs> Knock on door. Puppet human. What happens if we say we're a puppet? Puppets are a constant source of trouble. The hotel forbids all outside puppets. Please leave the premises. 
Oh, I thought it was gonna like kill us or something. Okay, this time we gotta say human. Puppets cannot lie. I guess that's one thing that makes us so special. The lying seems to be a big mechanic for this game. I'm guessing it's going to like determine what kind of ending we get is by how much we lie. So we're probably going to just stick to like telling the truth only. A good little Pinocchio. Hotel Karat. Lies of P. Lies of Pinocchio. Woo! This wasn't in demo. Okay, this is just telling us to. Okay, so this backstory of probably the town. Dim Ergo. That's definitely, uh, Geppetto making puppets. Yeah, I, I really do love the whole steampunk aesthetic to this. It gives me some very much like, uh, Bioshock Infinite vibes. I and mean, look at these guys. They literally remind me of handymen. I think that's what they would call, like, the big guys. Oh, okay, that's kind of creepy. I can't deny it looks kind of creepy, though. <laughs> Just a mechanical... Uh-oh. But then a frenzy started. Yep, and they started just killing every human that was in their way. Yeah, this wasn't part of the demo, but I like it. I like it a lot. Your great master we just defeated. Yeah, this frenzy. It's more than your normal frenzy, because it looks like it's take over most of the town of Krat. I think. It's hard to tell how big the place is yet. And there's our little Pinocchio. Hello, Pinocchio. Ah. I've only ever seen three Pinocchio movies. I've seen the original Disney classic cartoon. I've seen the Disney live action remake, which sucked. And of course, the Guillermo del Toro stop motion one, which was really good. And if it's not obvious by all the blue, you're obviously this version's this world's version of Blue Fairy. searched all over the city of Croft to find you. You must have questions. Geppetto will have answers, but we have to find him first. He was last seen on Elysian Boulevard. All of Croft is dangerous for humans, and that neighborhood is one of the scariest. Okay. Please find Geppetto on Elysian Boulevard. I'll explain more once you find him. So we need to find Geppetto. Lovely Emperor for seeing Ergo in your possession. Okay. Okay, so we can level up twice. I think I'm going to focus on vitality, vigor, and motivity. Capacity, maybe. Technique, I tend to focus more on strength and dexterity. And I don't know what Legion does yet or what all goes with it. So we're not using any advance yet. So for now, bada boom, bada bing. Uh, what's our max level right now? No, no, no. Uh, go ahead and level up, yeah. Okay, we're level 16. I see on the top right a little heart there, the 16. So we're level 16. I think he's in shock. Is fine. That's proof you're broken. The real Gemini isn't so calm. <laughs> I'm no inventor, but perhaps I can fix him. 
Or perhaps he'll fix himself in time. Wait. Take this pocket watch. Krat is a labyrinth of peril right now. This watch will guide you to a safe place. Okay. Be careful, clever one. Okay. Should I equip it to one of these? Well, I'm all out uh, electrical. Teleport to hotel or last dark use. Okay, that's not bad. Hello, good sir. You're a puppet. Welcome to Hotel Crop. My name is Polandina, butler to Lady Antonia. How are you in Please here? I thought puppets weren't allowed. I may be of service. At Hotel Crot, comfort and calm walk hand in hand. Welcome to Hotel Crot. How may I be of service? Talk, purchase. What do you have for me to buy? Help Catalyst, Legion Magazine. Legion's arm specific ability. Oh, our arm is the whole Legion thing. Okay, I see. At the Grand Covenant. Grand Covenant is a set of absolute commands imprinted on puppets when they are made. First law. All puppets must obey their creator's commands. Second law. A puppet may not harm humans. I don't think they're following Third that second law, law are they? <laughs> a puppet protects and serves humans and the city of Kraft. I don't think they're doing that. <laughs> a puppet cannot lie. This one I'm can. About the laws engraved upon every puppet. Do you require anything else? Ask for something else. Well, thanks for the information. Though I'm pretty sure the puppets are kind of breaking those laws right now since uh, they're out here killing everyone. Hello. I heard about you from Geppetto, but to see you in person. Wow. You should take this. Geppetto left it with me. Okay. What is it? Harpoon. I'm not saying no to that. Legion Army Special Perfect. Okay, puppet string. The There's no strings on me. <laughs> that craftsmanship comes only from the hands of Geppetto. You must be something else. A custom arm from Geppetto himself is quite an accessory. Oh, I forgot to introduce myself. I am Eugenie from the workshop you Eugenie. I know my way around weapons of all kinds. I'm sure Master Geppetto would agree. If any of your weapons need work, bring them to me. Okay. I know my way around a weapon. Want me to look at something? Sure. A great weapon. If you have a moonstone, Eugenie can help you upgrade a weapon's blade. Okay. Uh, oh, we don't have enough ergo. Well, okay. How much does it go up by? Alter handle. What does that do? Oh, okay, it just does. Okay, it just affects those. Let's go ahead and use on our Argo fragments. So we'll go ahead and upgrade our weapon. Let's just use Yeah, one's enough. I know my way around a weapon. Let's go ahead and upgrade this, get it stronger. We have no more hidden moonstone. We need two to upgrade it again. But now it's stronger, which is good. So I see the cat. Hello. Oh, the cat's not a fan of us. What is this? <laughs> I recognize this place according to rules, so don't touch anything, Eugenie. Okay. Well, thank you for the arm and upgrade. We don't insist on reservations. I am Antonia. And this is my hotel. Welcome. Thank you. Oh, I knew from the moment we met the George Petto's puppet. He might have a few loose screws, but Geppetto's skills are undiminished. It's a shame. He took off for Elysian Boulevard, and he never came back. 
Well, we plan to help get him back. Up soon. We'll have to make a new coffin. <laughs> oh, I forgot. I was keeping this for him. It comes with a long story. But I think it's better off with you. What is Please it? Please find that old man. And do take care of yourself out there. Someone's memories. Show off clothes. Someone's memories. Okay, we got clothes now? Okay, costumes. We don't have any accessories, do we? No, but we just gained someone's memory outfit. Okay. What else? We have... Do we have any amulets? No. Defensive parts. Okay. It brings up our uh, damage reduction by more, but it also brings up our weight. Which is not good, but as long as we can still do a lot of the attacks and whatnot we can do here, it'd be best to have it. Yeah, can we still dodge? Oh, okay. It does seem like it's slower now. So it seems like I need to get under 50. If that's the case, then... Cannot be changed? Great. That's not helpful. What about usable items? Do those have any weight to them? None of them seem to have any weight to them, so it's mostly just accessory-based items. Man, I might actually need to upgrade capacity then. There we go. There we go. Okay, but now with that done... Yeah. Yeah, it still seems like we can dodge pretty well, so I think we can keep that. Yeah, I think that's where we need to go next, but let's look upstairs first. You never know what could be around here. Mm, nothing over there. Anything over here? Loctite? Okay. How about this? We need the Rosa Isabel Street in here. Okay. We don't have that key, so that's a no. Can't go in there. Where's the items from Aldina? Aldina at the hotel. Okay. Well, for now, let's continue on. So we'll go and find Geppetto.